Amatse is a word from the Nahuatl language, meaning paper, and it was highly used by Mesoamerican cultures. It is created from the bark of the wild fig tree, mulberry tree, and nettle tree, and each produce a unique tone and color, ranging from bright whites to dark browns. Traditionally, the men peel the bark from the trees, and the women begin the process of making the paper, which includes washing the bark, boiling it with lime, and pounding it with stone until it becomes a paste, finally being laid out in the sun to dry. The paintings done by the Nahuatl speaking folk artist come from the region Mescala, located on the Rio Balsas Basin in Guerrero State. This region's natural beauty has been a large inspiration upon the development of the highly valued folk art painting styles in Mexico. Many artists from this region traveled throughout the country during the 1950s, 60s, and 70s, selling their artwork to many of the tourists and travelers. And in the 1970s, Amate paintings gained national recognition from the work of artist Pedro de Jesus, Cristino Flores Medina, and Felipe Ehrenberg, whose idea was for them to start painting on Amate and selling it through Max Curlo's art gallery in Mexico City. Now this painting here that I'm showcasing to you depicts many scenes of everyday life, the plants and animals of the region, and a wide assortment of all the fruits they grow and harvest, as well as Mazapotec psilocybin mushrooms, which can be found twice in the painting and suggest their psychedelic use during the 1950s and 60s.